Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel, man. I hope you guys are having a great day. I was just about to go to the gym, but my elbow was flaring up a little bit and I wanted to share with you guys three supplements that I've been taking for a while that have helped me out so, so much with my joint pain. And when I stopped taking these supplements that I'm gonna show you guys, my joint pain and my tendonitis started to come back and flare up and that's what's currently happening right now. So while I've got these three supplements, I wanna share them with you guys. Now, to give you guys a little background story of myself, I've been lifting for seven years. Uh, I did bodybuilding for a lot of those seven years and now I'm transitioning to a little bit more of power lifting and getting my strength. Just, just trying to squat heavy and bench heavier and deadlift heavier as well so that's kind of where I'm at right now I also played basketball in high school I played you know several different sports I did boxing and basketball in high school and I started to develop kind of like tendonitis and joint pain in my right elbow my right shoulder and my left knee and I've always had problems with those specific joints and I even have a you know a little bit of tears in my labrum in my right shoulder so um, that's kind of my story that's my my back my background story of injuries and tendonitis and stuff like that so let's get into the main thing of this video so the first thing fish oil now fish oil is probably the first thing that a lot of people would recommend It's great for so many different things um, I take one to two of these a day and if my tendonitis is really flaring up I take three now if you're Muslim like me and you can't have gelatin um, I called the this company right here nature's bounty and I talked to a representative and they told me that there is no pork gelatin uh, in these fish oils if you are concerned about that. So I take one to three of these a day, usually just one. Another thing that I, I love to take is this Move Free by Schiff. I don't know exactly uh, if that's the correct, correct uh, pronunciation. This has glucosamine hydrochloride, chondroitin sulfate sodium, hyaluronic acid, and calcium fructoborate. Now, uh, obviously, I'm, I'm not going to get into the science behind each and every ingredient, but these are generally the ingredients that you're going to see in uh, joint support supplements. So glucosamine, chondroitin, and MSM is also sometimes in these uh, supplements, but the one that I use is this more free one. And I'm not sponsored by anybody, um, so don't I don't have like any bias or anything like that. And then the third supplement I take is turmeric. Now turmeric is an anti-inflammatory supplement. It's really healthy um, for most of the people. If you're just a general healthy uh, individual, you, you can take turmeric and all of these other supplements. Now before you take any of these supplements, I would consult with a physician uh, or, or with a doctor and see that you know it's safe for you to take all of this stuff right here. Um, but turmeric in general is really good for anti inflammation so it's, it helps with the inflammatory response of your body and then it also claims that it promotes cardiovascular immune joint and skin health so those are some other benefits of turmeric now this one these have vegetarian capsules the specific brand spring valley and so you don't have to worry about pork uh, in that and then these ones don't have pork either the move free capsules let me show you guys how big each capsule is because um, when I was younger, I really struggled with taking big uh, caps or big tablets, I guess you could say. Hopefully it can focus. There we go. So there's that one. It's, uh, it's relatively big, actually. It doesn't look that big um, in the camera, but it's really easy to swallow. They coated it with a certain like slippery coating that allows it to go down your throat easily. And then the turmeric. Ooh, that stinks. So there we go, there's the turmeric. And I'm gonna pull out one of each so you guys can see the relative sizes compared to one another. So there they are. Obviously the fish oil is the biggest one. And then the turmeric is uh, longer than the move free capsule um, or tablet, but the move free is a little bit thicker. But you get, you get pretty used to them after a while and they're pretty easy to swallow. And uh, if, if you have a hard time um, swallowing big pills then I would try to find an alternative like mini fish oils and uh, I believe they have mini tablets for these as well if you really really struggle with swallowing bigger pills so that is pretty much it those are the three things that I take fish oil turmeric and then the move three tap move free tablets those are the three supplements that I take to help me with my tendonitis and to help with my joint pain whenever I'm feeling really really sore and stiff 
and at this age, I'm, I'm 23, I've been lifting for seven years, um, I have to probably start taking these on a regular basis, especially the turmeric and the fish oil. The move free, I would probably only take when my uh, joints really, really hurt or, or when I have a really bad inflammation in one of my tendons. Um, but other than that, the fish oil and the turmeric is something that you could take every day, even if you don't specifically feel um, tendonitis or joint pain. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you guys are new here, please don't forget to subscribe. Also drop a like, it would help me out so, so much. And inshallah, I'll see you guys in the next video.